I feel empty but I'm a baby. I don't wish this on no mom. No mom. The pain of a mother in full force, the suspect in her teen daughter's death appearing in court after a manhunt to find him. We thank you for joining us on NBC4 Midday. I'm Brad Johansson, 18 year old Rashawn Atkins Jr. charged in the murder connected to the death of 15 year old Lovely Kendricks, who was killed at Franklin Park back on October 10th. NBC4's Matthew Herchick was in the courtroom this morning. Matthew, you spoke to the family afterwards. Uh, what today mean for them, I guess, is, is the big question. Yeah, good morning, Brad. Well, you heard from Lovely's mother, Doris Moore, there. As you can imagine, today was just an incredibly emotional moment for them. She called today a relief, but said that nothing will bring her baby back. Moore and Lovely's father, Clarence Roberts, were joined by about a dozen or so other family members in the courtroom today. They sat there and watched the 18-year-old Atkins appear virtually before Franklin County Judge. Atkins is accused of shooting a gun into a crowd after a fight broke out at the park that afternoon. Atkins was arrested Monday by SWAT members, but Moore said that the past six weeks have been hell for their family. They've been posting Atkins' picture in neighborhoods, at stores, on social media. And while the appearance was brief, the family says for them it was the first step in getting justice for their daughter. I just felt a sense of relief. That's it. I'm still hurting. Can't erase that. So I just feel a sense of relief because he's caught and he will do time. That's what I wanted. Uh, Lovely's parents said that their daughter and Atkins did not know each other. She had just began school at East High School. They said she didn't know a lot of people and said she was supposed to be safe at the park that day. Atkins was given a $1 million bond and is due back in court on December 1st. Local for you at the Franklin County Courthouse, Matthew Herchick, NBC4.